Hello little guys and today no! I hang on one second. No! Okay, so let me do my intro again. Hello guys and today what I'm going to be doing is I am going to be answering some questions that I get asked a lot. So I don't get them asked on YouTube videos, I get them asked on like um, like out in school or like out in the real world or when I'm at church or something like that. So, one question that I get asked a lot is, why do you wear bows so much? Like, what is it with bows? And why I wear bows so much is I think they're fashionable. Like... You guys don't see me wearing them on YouTube videos, but if you see me in public, I wear them every single day. Every single day. I don't know, just one time I put on a bow. I got attached. Well, actually, my mom put on a bow for me. I wore it, and then the next day I wore it, the next day I wore it, the next day I wore it, the next day I wore it. It was like, I was, I, it's like I fell in love with fashion. I just think they're fashionable. Another, I'm only going to do 10 questions. Another question that I get asked a lot is, did you ever pierce your ears? So, I had an infection. So, yes, I did pierce my ears, but I had an infection. And after my infection, I didn't ever want to do it again. Like, I look cute in earrings, but then I had an infection. And it still looks red, and I still have holes in my ears, but it's red around it. So, yes, I did have earrings once, but for a short time. The third question that people ask me is, why don't you run much? So, I do love running, but I don't like, for some reason, I don't like running at school. But I love running. Now, most people in my family don't even think I love running. But I do, I actually run a lot. So, there's this thing called our fun room at our school. And it's where um, where you run 35 laps, 65 laps, I don't know, laps. And I and my friends, like, never seen me run before. And she's like, wow, you run fast. And I'm like, yeah, I kind of do love running. And she's like, wow, you do run fast. She's, and then the next day, she, and I didn't run, and she said, you're not fast. And I'm like. You just, you seriously just told me that yes that I was fast yesterday. Okay. So the fourth question that I get um asked a lot is um I'm trying to think of one. Okay. So they asked me, Do you think your hair is gonna be curly forever? This mostly gets asked at school and I say it probably not because right now it's getting it's, it gets straight when I, like, of course it gets straight when it gets wet, but it takes a long time for it to get curly again. It, well, it doesn't take a long time, but it kind of takes a long time for me. But I'm just not patient. But I'm pretty sure when I get older, it will straighten out, which that is very sad. Very sad. Because I love my curls. Fifth question that I get asked a lot is who, who picks out my clothes? So I get asked this at church a lot. So I say this. So usually my mom picks out my clothes for church, but for rest of stuff, um, I pick out my stuff like for um just on like Saturdays and for school and stuff like that. But people ask, who picks out your clothes? Because you look really cute. And I'm like, my mom. It's, I just love it. Um, the sixth question that I get asked a lot is. Oh, am I a whore, hoarder or am I, don't care. I am a hoarder. If you guys don't know what that means, it means you keep a lot of stuff. I get it from my grandma. Well, I call her my mula. I get
get it from her a lot. She, if you walk into her garage, it has a bunch of stuff. But I'm not as much as her. It's okay. But I am a hoarder. Another question that I get asked a lot is, where do I get my beds from? I don't actually know this question really, but my mom usually answers it. And she said to my first grade teacher, which was like a while back, like two years ago. And she said that they're actually taking away the store, so I can't really get any more bows. But I can because there's more out there. So, yeah. The seventh question I get asked a lot is... Do you wear glasses? Well, I say yes, but I don't wear them like every day. I just wear them for reading. So yes, I do wear glasses. Like some people think that, like when they first beat me, they think, like last year, we had two, wait, three new students. And they're like, hey, do you wear glasses? And I'm like, no, but now I do, now I do. So the eighth question that I am going to be answering is, why did you quit horseback riding? Now, why I quit it is because the horseback rider girl was actually pretty mean. She was like, do this, do that. And I had to do it like perfectly or she'd start doing it and get mad at me. And, um... My mom and Andrew would keep on asking, why did you drop out? Why do you, why, why? And I'd, and I'd kind of lie to them and say, it's because it costs so much money. Because it costs $50 per week. And so, um, and then Andrew finally has a friend that used to go to McClendon Hills, which is where I go, or used to go. And she said that she, she was pretty mean, too, and doesn't know what she was talking about, really. And then Andrew noticed that, too. So that's that. So the ninth question is, what is, what? I don't get asked this oftenly, but I do get asked this to people who don't really know me. What do you want to be when I grow up? So if you did my Who Knows Me Better um, thing, then you'll know that I want to be a vet. So yes, I do want to be a vet. And I really want to be a vet. And it's because I have a very big passion for animals. And I and I love dogs. Mostly a lot of... I love horses. I love dogs. I love every animal on this earth. And then the tenth question. A lot of people don't know my age. Sometimes my family always forgets. Like, they say, you're seven, right? You're not. And I'm like, no, I'm eight. Gosh, can you get this right? That is the 10th question. And I hope you guys liked this video. I hope you learned some more um, things about me. If you did, then smash the like button. Yeah, thank you.